will be, this is a part of it, but will be when we denuclearize that entire peninsula. This is what people have been waiting for for a long time. Nobody thought we could be on this track in terms of speed. So I'm very honored to have helped the three folks. They're great people. You know, I got, I got to speak to them on the plane. These are great people. They've been through a lot, but it's, uh, it's a great honor. But the great, the, the true honor is going to be if we have a victory in getting rid of nuclear weapons. Have you heard what he has to say? Thank you, Secretary of State. Does that change how you will approach your meeting with Kim Jong-un? No, not at all. Uh, we very much appreciate that he allowed them to go before the meeting. It was sort of understood that we'd uh, be able to get these three terrific people during the meeting and bring them home after the meeting. And he was nice in letting him go before the meeting. I mean, frankly, we didn't think this was going to happen, and it did. So you could say we're a little bit ahead. It was a very important thing to all of us to be able to get these three great people out. And I, I must tell you, I want to pay my warmest respects to the parents of Otto Warbier, who is a great young man who, who really suffered. And his parents have become friends of ours. They are spectacular people. And I just want to pay my respects. I actually called them the other day. And Mike called them also, Mike Pence. And uh, they are really incredible people. I think our Secretary of State, despite the fact that the New York Times said he was missing, he was in North Korea, but I think our Secretary of State has done a fantastic job. Uh, Mike, did you know that you were missing? They couldn't find him. They couldn't find him. They, they couldn't find him because he was in North Korea. You know, so. I don't want to comment on whether or not I spoke to him. Well, we're starting off on a new footing. This is a wonderful thing that he released the folks early. That was a big thing, very important to me. And I really think we have a very good chance of doing something very meaningful. And if anybody would have said that five years ago, 10 years ago, even a year ago, you would have said that's not possible. So a lot, I will say this, a lot of very good things have happened. Say it. I really think he wants to do something. I think he did this because I really think he wants to do something and bring that country into the real world. I really believe that, John, and I think I think that we're going to have a success. I think this will be a very big success. It's never been taken this far. There's never been a relationship like this, and we're starting from here. But uh, I really think a lot of progress has been made, and. We'll see what happens. We're talking about a few weeks. I guess many of you will be with us, but some great things can happen, and that's what we hope. So I want to thank you all. It's very early in the morning. Uh, I think you probably broke the all-time in history television rating for 3 o'clock in the morning, that I would say. But I want to just congratulate. These are three great people, and congratulations. Have you gotten any sleep or are you too excited?